All right, guys. So here is the tank. Um, that is the stock one. That's a small one. And it's like I don't know how much bigger it is, but it says it's 12 liters. So that should last a lot longer than the small one. All right, let's go ahead and test this. Oh. あ、出てる出てる。そうだね。まあまあ、ないよりは。マシだね。多分走ってたら What's up guys, it's Kino. Today, uh, we're gonna be doing some work on the STA again. On the last vlog, I left off with the water tank installation in the trunk. Uh, if you haven't watched it yet, go check it out. And um, before that, I installed the uh, water spray nozzle for the front mount intercooler. On both of those videos, the water was running like the entire time and I couldn't figure it out until I posted the previous vlog. But uh, yeah, uh, because the water tank is above the nozzle itself, it will pretty much like empty out the tank until like all the water's gone. Um, so yeah, that's why I bought one of these. Uh, this is a one-way valve. It has like a spring and a ball inside. So that it only opens when there's pressure going through one side and it closes when there's no pressure at all. So yeah, uh, that will help. So I'm gonna install that real quick and let's give it a test. So it's gonna be a quick one. I have to take this off. I have to plug in the valve. And in the previous vlog, I got so many comments saying that I need uh, more pressure for the water to spray like like a mist but um i figured out why uh it's the uh hose that i'm using it's really really soft i bought a cheap one don't cheap out on your car uh like i did just now but yeah uh, so i'm gonna be replacing that um maybe next time but today uh let's try installing this It was a quick install. So uh, this brand is called Straight. It's a Japanese company that makes it. And there's an arrow right there. Uh, so you know which way is the uh, input and output. So let's hope this works. And uh, like I was saying, this hose, that's a stock one. It's a lot stiffer than this. This is like really soft. So it's probably expanding. Because um, a lot of people were saying I have to change the motor to change the uh, pressure. But that's where Spec C uh, tank is located in the trunk. So um, that should have enough pressure, right? Because it's supposed to bring it up to the, uh, the hood. Because that's where the stock one goes. So yeah, um, distance wise, uh, because there's like a long hose running on the hood, it doesn't really make that much of a difference. So let's test this. Let's test. Yep, it's spraying. Not enough, uh, not enough pressure because the hose in the front uh, is really soft. I'll replace that later on, but yeah. Okay. Come on, it stopped. Nice. Kore de more na yokata. Ne, jiguk da yo. Ne, datte ore kaette kara zutto poto poto kobore sta kara. 
ってこれ朝起きたらもうなくなってんだろうなと思って案の定タンク12リッター全部空っぽいになってて<笑>確かにこの間ここずっとびちゃびちゃだったもんねそうそうそうそうそう,そう出てんなと思ってた<笑>俺の駐車場もびちゃびちゃだったで近所の人たちはずっとなこう覗きながらそうそうそうそうそうそうなるよね,ね<笑>ありがとうあよかったよかった I gave Otatsu so many things、um, and I'm About to give him my front brake disc for several reasons I'll explain in another vlog. But yeah,、uh, because I haven't given anything to Ikepon and he's been helping me a lot, I'm gonna give him. What are those? This. I get just these. The shift knob. Wee! <laughs> That's the one I used to use. And that's the same juice as the beads. Oh, it's a nice. Wait, wait, wait. Tabo, it looks good. It's a nice color. It's a nice color. It's a nice color. It's a nice color. And we're about to go down to wash our cars because it's not going to be raining for at least an entire week. We're all going to wash our cars in different styles. So,、um, with Ikepon's Evo, he has ceramic coats on his Evo. So, yeah,、uh, we're gonna compare that with、uh, my wax and we'll see how different they look so that you guys could like try whatever you like, you know? We are at a car wash. And the Subi and the Evo are getting a car wash. It's been dirty for quite a while now. Look at the Evo, it's got the dust. <laughs> And so does mine. It's been raining for. It's been raining real frequently. So, yeah,、uh, even the roof. And that is all gonna be clean today. I'll show you guys how I usually detail.、Um, right before the show, I usually put like seven layers, but today I think it's just gonna be like maybe two or three.、Um, Depending on how I feel, but yeah. Jumbi, are you ready? Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. All right, so we finished washing it. I had to make it quick because there's a timer on that machine, but I'll show you guys how I usually detail. STI is dry now. It's kind of humid, so the roof is kind of、uh, wet, but it should be fine.、Um, so the first step I'm going to go with is 
I always use uh, Chemical Guys. Uh, it is the uh, ultimate glaze. What this does is uh, it gives that extra sh uh, shininess to the car. If you're interested, go check out their YouTube channel. They they explain everything. I learned a lot from their website. Um, some people say you don't even need all these, but um, the first time I took my car to the show, after putting like seven layers, it was like really glossy. Uh, so, and I really liked it. And it actually is really different with like, if you compare it with uh, three layers or four layers against seven layers. But today, uh, we're just gonna do three because we're not preparing for a show or anything. And the next step, it's gonna be the jet seal. So this is what's gonna cover the glaze and it's gonna make it last longer. So it's like the coating for glaze. And you can always skip this step and just go straight to glaze, I mean jet seal. And if I have the energy, I might put some wax spray over it but it depends I might save it for a show that and just like let it spread everywhere and just repeat the process on the entire body with all the layers and it's gonna take forever but it's gonna be worth it uh, he, he kept on. He is already done because obviously a uh, ceramic coat, you just wash it, dry it, that's it. You are not allowed to put any wax on it. So yeah, he is done. But yeah, I'm gonna make sure mine shines a lot better than his. Ooh, that's shiny. Ooh, man. <laughs> I gotta work hard. <laughs> I already showed you guys all the all the coatings that I'm gonna be applying so I'll show you guys when I am done all right guys so the first layer is done look at the reflection sick and yeah um that's only the first coat I'm gonna have at least two more layers. I'm not sure if I'm going to do the spray, but uh, yeah. That's the first first layer. Let me know what you guys think. All right, so this is after layer two. And it's more obvious when I show you the fender like that. Damn, look at that. It's really humid right now, so uh, the car's fogging up, but uh, yeah. I hope you could see it. I hope the camera's catching it. You could see both green and blue, like, really well merging, right? Same goes on the other side. Sick. All right, guys, so we are done washing the car, polishing it, detailing it. So here's after the third layer. Damn, look at that. This 
this is Ikebon's Evo after he washed it and he polished it a little but I think to be honest it's about the same when it comes to glossiness so like I think um, ceramic coating I think it's way easier because he washed it he polished it just twice and he was done he was just waiting for me the whole time uh, with me I had to work on the car for the longest time and this is only three layers I usually do like seven layers when I bring it to shows so yeah um, maintenance wise well like if you if you don't want to waste time then go get it ceramic coated uh, if you want like extra glossiness I think after seven layer wax might be better but yeah so here's a comparison let me know what you think in the comment down below it's just a preference it's not like one is better than the other because uh, wax it takes time it wears off but ceramic coating it's the same you have to do maintenance and uh, when you get it ceramic coated you have to let it dry let it sit dry for about a month before it could actually touch water because you could get like rain spots like that that's gonna be permanent when it comes to ceramic coating so that's one con about ceramic coat but other than that it's like the easiest way and personally I want to get it but before that I want to get my car repainted again um, I think the color is going to be the same I just want to fix the rock chips and everything you know because behind the fenders yeah it's pretty bad when you're wearing high grip tires it's like 3 in the morning right now and yeah let me show you Ikepon's new shift knob shift knob shift knob <laughs> so if you saw my previous vlogs uh, that was his shift knob <laughs> I know some of you were asking if I would sell this but uh, I think my friend Ikepon <laughs> deserves it. He's been helping me a lot. So yeah, let's get to the show. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. いい感じ、いい感じ。いいじゃん。青、青ぴったりだね。うん。いい感じ。ナイス。いやいや。ありがとうございます。いいじゃん。青、青ぴったりだね。うん。いい感じ。ナイス。いやいや。ありがとうござい
So I'm gonna close off. Thanks so much for watching guys. Don't forget, like, comment, and subscribe. Peace.